Number 7. 2023 Alfa Romeo Tonali. The Alfa Romeo Tonali is aimed at young, urban, and dynamic customers, with sensuous bodywork highlighted by Alfa Romeo. Romeo Tanelli's signature sharp-nosed face is sure to draw admiring glances. The interior is finished with a combination of aluminum trim and leather, and the dashboard is covered in micro suede. There is a 12.3-inch digital gauge cluster, as well as a three-spoke steering wheel with a modern twist on a traditional design. Front sport seats with red contrast stitching and Alfa Romeo badging on the armrests the Tonali will be discovered beneath the hood. The base model comes with a 9-speed automatic transmission and a turbocharged 2-liter inline 4 producing 256 horsepower and 295 pound-feet of torque. The optional plug-in hybrid is powered by a turbocharged 1.3-liter four-cylinder engine and an electric motor mounted on the rear axle, totaling 272 horsepower. Its price is not yet known, but the base model is expected to start at $30,000, with the top end starting at $50,000. Number 6. 2023 Maserati Gracale. Maserati Gracale will face direct competition in 2023 if it is positioned below the line of sight. Competitors include the Porsche Mackin Jaguar F-Pace and the Range Rover Veeler. The Grecian appears sporty yet glamorous. Look, but not so much that you're confused. In order to create a miniature version of Levante the highest quality Gracal Trofeo is powered by the MC20's 3-liter V6 with a pair of turbochargers, producing 523 horsepower and 457 pound-feet of torque and reaching 62 miles per hour. In 3.8 seconds and top out at 177 miles per hour. The Grizel's interior is very different from what we now know of the Gracali which is a Maserati inside the cockpit. Modern technologies such as a 12.3-inch digital gauge cluster and a pair of touchscreens on the center stack the material used for the interior details would also be unique, depending on the version. For example, you'll notice more the Tesla model is constructed of carbon fiber. The starting grade will be 64995 The price of a modern limited edition begins at $78,800. Trofeos, on the other hand, costs $1.95. The price has yet to be announced, but it is expected to be more than $100,000. Number 5. 2022 BMW XM60. The XM60 2022 appears to have only a few details set it apart. M60 badging on the rear 21-inch two-tone aero wheels, brake calipers, performance blue paint, and BMW individual titanium bronze exterior package distinguishes it from regular versions. Inside, it featured the Because I Drive a BMW Operating System 8, just like recent BMWs. A wide and curved display sat as a floating glass panel on the dashboard, integrating the instrument cluster and the infotainment unit's touchscreen. The XM60 is powered by two electric motors with a total capacity of 533 horses and 749 pound-feet of torque, increasing to 610 horses and 811 pound-feet on the planet in sport mode. With this power, the electric SUV can accelerate from a standstill to 62 miles per hour in 3.6 seconds and reach a top speed of 155 miles per hour. In a BMW, the maximum driving range is estimated to be 351 miles on a single charge. In 2022, the iXM60 will begin at 105,100. If you want a high-performance SUV but don't want the moral burden of using so much more fuel, the XM60 is well worth the money. Number 4. Range Rover Sport in 2023. The third-generation Range Rover Sport is now available for pre-order and will be available for purchase in 2023. The SC model costs $84,350 while the first edition costs $122,840. The new Range Rover Sport interior is a significant improvement over the previous one, 
with a 13.1-inch touchscreen infotainment system dominating the dashboard, but you'll be relieved to know that there are some physical climate controls below. In conjunction with the rear seat entertainment package you'll get two more 11.4-inch screens in the back of the Meridian Signature sound system, which has 29 speakers, a subwoofer, and an amplifier capable of producing 1430 watts of power. In terms of engines, the most recent the most powerful model is the P530. Addition with a 4.4-liter twin-turbocharged V8, producing 523 horsepower and 553 pound-feet of torque. Or enough to accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.3 seconds. More high-performance SVR models powered by a BMW V8 engine with at least 600 horses will be available in the near future. A few years later, in 2024, an all-electric version of the SUV will be released. Number 3. 2023 Lotus Electric. Lotus, like other sports car manufacturers such as Lamborghini, Ferrari, and Aston Martin, has decided to enter the SUV market in order to increase the company's sales. This is Lotus' first SUV, and it's another all-electric vehicle. The hardcore will be dissatisfied with this year. Its exterior is eye-catching, borrowing design elements from the Amira and the Aveja. Other Lotus models appear to be more digital than Electra. A set of 23-inch light alloy wheels completed the car's high-performance look. The Electra is the company's first model built on the new high-end EPA architecture platform which includes a battery pack with a capacity of more than 100 kilowatts and two electric motors that drive the four wheels. It generates a total of 592 horsepower. Because of this, the SUV can accelerate from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 3 seconds, with a top speed of 162 miles per hour. The electric interior has a minimalist design with a wide dashboard, accompanied by high-quality materials, and a 15.1-inch OLED touchscreen in the center that can be folded and opened when needed. The SUV has a wheelbase of up to 118.9 inches, making the interior space quite comfortable and spacious. Number 2. 2022 Porsche Cayenne Turbo GT. The Porsche Cayenne Turbo GT has been improved. The Cayenne Coupe has a high-end version that ranks above both the Turbo and the SC Hybrid. Moving inside, the most noticeable improvement is Porsche's new entertainment system, which is outfitted with sporty Alcantara and sports seats as well as specific ornamental features. The KN Turbo GT is powered by a 631 twin turbocharged 4-liter V8 engine with horsepower and torque rated at 626 pound-feet, backed by Porsche's familiar ZF sourced, 8-speed automatic transmission with a sprint time to 60 miles per hour of just 3.1 seconds and a top speed of 186 miles per hour, making it Porsche's fastest SUV to date. The KN Turbo GT starts at 182,150 and is available for purchase right now. Number 1. 2022 Aston Martin DBX 707. The 2022 DBX 707 has a sporty and appealing appearance, as well as a powerful engine that performs admirably. It has some exterior differences in the front and back that improve aerodynamics and aesthetics over the standard version. The most noticeable difference was the addition of embroidered Aston Martin logo headrests to the sports bucket seats. Unfortunately, the entertainment system is unchanged from the standard DBX. The DBX 707 is based on the standard DBX, but the output of the AMS twin turbo V8 has been tuned up to 697 horsepower and 663 pound-feet of torque, which are routed to a rear-based all-wheel drive system via a new wet clutch, 9-speed automatic gearbox, with a 7% reduction in final drive distance. The Super SUV can reach 60 miles per hour in 3.1 seconds and has a top speed of 193 miles per hour, making it the fastest luxury SUV in the world. The 2022 DBX 707 has a starting price of $239,000 before options. 